Hello and welcome back to the channel. This is the continuation of my, I was going to say something else then, my Batman Arkham Knight her playthrough. Uh, we are heading now towards Stag's Enterprises, uh, looking for Norman Stag. Um, so yes, we have to obviously figure out a way how to get in there, how to work out what's around there. So. Uh, Let's uh, get this going. Sir, Stag's airships have been hooked and tethered. We're reeling him in. Good. Get in there, find Stag, and interrogate him. And Lieutenant, I'm assigning you an extra unit for guard duty. Who are we guarding? Scarecrow. The boss wants to come aboard. That's right. See, I've never really, obviously, talked about this on video <coughs> uh, before, really. But uh, obviously, you may have noticed that I've been obviously covering a vast majority of single-player-based games, and the reason for that is because. I, I much prefer single player experiences to multiplayer you know there's only probably a couple of games this is, this is games that I've actually I enjoyed the online on that would be being uh, G, uh, GTA obviously because everyone everyone loves that and Red Dead Redemption they're the only online experiences that I've thoroughly enjoyed the rest of them I can't stand um, so yeah I always like to uh, uh, to uh, play single player games. That's that's my uh, sort of uh, my uh, that's what I love. That's what I, I enjoy. So uh, so yeah, it, you know anything with multiplayer, I just groan because that's you know that's kind of what ruined Origins for me as well. They put multiplayer in it, and you know it's completely it was completely redundant. You Assassin's Creed did the same, and it's trash. Why did they put multiplayer in? What, just to make a quick buck? Go make a quick buck on something else. Ubisoft's been plucking Assassin's Creed out for every year, for God knows how long now, and they're still doing it. Oh what, they're going to take a year's break next year? Go fuck yourself. I can guarantee you, next year, a remastered edition of, I don't know, Assassin's Creed 3 is probably coming out. So, you know, something's coming out next year. You may be taking a break, but you're still releasing an Assassin's Creed. So, you're not taking a break. Stop lying, Ubisoft. So, yeah. That's why I'm looking forward to uh, Spider-Man because it's gonna, it's not gonna have any multiplayer. It's gonna be all fully single-player by focused, and uh, obviously uh, it's uh, it should be a good experience. So hopefully, enjoy that one when it's uh, next Friday. But it's, yeah, this next Friday. So not long now, but have it's gonna, you know, and set up a watch that's gonna take priority on the guns. channel, so look Looks out like for it's that. controlled from that central command point. I need to take it out. That soldier is equipped with a device that can track my detective mode systems. If I use it for too long, they'll be able to pinpoint my location and alert the others. I know. I know all about him. He's an idiot. Right, the detective man is now down. So I'm now gonna take out these chumps. Uh Target lost! Spread out, I'm gonna check for casualties. Nothing we can do here. Spread out and find him. 
one more to go. Okay, I've taken out the militia. Now to disable the tower. Oh, alright. Need to equip the explosive gel, turn that off. So yeah, this is an introduction to another side mission. It, the, all these side missions for the militia actually uh, then molds the into one. What did you so. find? Well, the ship's original schematics reveal a service hatch that should be accessible from the top of the aircraft. It would seem Mr. Stagg is rather protective of his research. I mean, I wouldn't blame him, but he's still an idiot. Thanks, Alfred. Lucius, how's the remote hacking device coming along? I think I'm about to need it. Maybe you should add clairvoyance to that job description, Mr. Wayne. I'm uploading the latest decryption software to the device in the vault at Wayne International Plaza. You can collect it from there. I think that's the same voice actor that did Lucius Fox in uh, Oh, Enemy Within on uh, the Telltale games for Batman. Um, so yeah, I think it is. I, I could be wrong, but it sounds familiar, very similar, should we say? But yeah, uh, obviously my experience with the Batman games is, as I've probably previously stated, that I've played all of them, including Origins. Even though I don't, I don't count that in the in the whole series because it wasn't made by Rocksteady so I don't really count it but um, yeah I'll play them all and I would say I probably uh, didn't really enjoy Origins didn't really get it but you know I enjoyed Asylum I think I enjoyed Asylum the most Arkham Asylum I think that was the best one personally because obviously it was the first one so it but it was uh very good, should we say? Very, very good. All right. There's a service hatch on top of the airship. I can use the remote hacking device to get in. Yeah, you can. Alright, it's fly on, or glide onto it. You don't fly. He doesn't fly. is locked from inside. If I can locate the control panel. Uh, what am I looking for? I'll be able to bypass security using the remote hacking device. Yeah, this is very prominent in Arkham City. Can do something with that. Hey, what are you doing? Just giving you a little demonstration. As you can see, the targeting and maneuvering. I need to get closer. Perfect. Take a look. The light is white. That's good. That means it's just identified you as a friendly. In this mode, you're safe. Just remember, when the light is red, you become a target. What are we supposed to do then? Then you stay out of its way. The onboard CPU creates a unique and unhackable network. This device is the only thing that can pass control information. The soldiers are using an unmanned drone. 
If I can download the security code, I've got the codes. Now I can turn that drone against them. <laughs> Hilarious. Scarecrow's forces have moved through this place, killing everyone. They must be there for a reason, sir. What are they planning? Barbara's the priority. When she's safe, I'll deal with them. But, sir, you have the chance to end this now. Capture Scarecrow, and you can save the whole city. It's what Miss Gordon would want. I'm not losing anyone else, Alfred. Who might find a place for his or herself within our organization. Or perhaps you're an investor. A lot of dead bodies, let's put it that way. Now I've got to figure out where the bloody hell I'm going. I should now have full rotational control of the airship stability system. Mm -hmm. However, the hacking device will only work within a certain range of any control terminal. Alright, there we go. That's all I need to do on that one. I've read the trophy. And a big dude. <laughs> I've been waiting for it. There you go, punch in the face. Nice and simple. Yeah, nice try. 
get rid of the big dude. Someone was still alive. <laughs> Batman! Oh, thank God you're here! Uh, thank you. They, they were going to kill me. Why? What did you do? Nothing. These animals came in and just started shooting. They were collecting those cylinders. Nimbus generators. A totally clean power cell technology we've been developing. Where's Scarecrow? He's on the second airship. Did he have anyone with him? Oh, you mean Barbara Gordon? I think we both know she's probably dead, don't we, Bats? <laughs> yeah, now this gets all weird. <laughs> all started getting up. Stag's been taken to Scarecrow on the second airship, but it's protected by gun turrets. Bear with me a moment, sir. Right. The schematics show a security terminal in the research laboratory towards the rear of your current vessel. You should be able to disable the turrets from there. Wonderful. Which way? Oh, hang on, I gotta. Nearly <laughs> bats. I could feel you losing control there. A little more of that delicious fear gas, and it will be all over for you. You think you stopped me at Ace Chemicals, Batman? <laughs> you merely delayed the inevitable. Gotham is mine to do with as I please. And the same can be said of your friend. Poor little Barbara Gordon. Close your eyes. Can you see her? Cowering in the darkness. Cursing the hero who failed her. She has become your weakness. Your obsession, 
dragging you deeper in I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand oh clear of the containers before Seriously, tilting the airship. Bro. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. Lock that. Oh no, no, we didn't need to mean to do that. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. in the wrong button. <laughs> oh dear. Stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. What was the point of opening that? Up I should stand clear of the I'm containers pleased. before tilting the airship. Stupid idiot. I should stand clear oh of my the containers God, before off. tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. I am fucking clear, prick. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. Oh my god, can you actually the piss off, mate? Seriously. I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. Yeah, it's all because of this fucking... Oh, I don't even know which...
Like, what was the entire point of opening that for, for a Riddler trophy? I should stand clear of the containers before tilting the airship. Just in case. God. All that to get out of there. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Another dead man. To the laboratory. Look, about what happened down there. I wasn't trying to kill you. I was trying to kill your mind. So, uh, we still pals? <laughs> Friends for life. Anyway, don't blame me. Blame Scarecrow and his patented joke of liberating miracle Get talk. Go away, Joe. Find him. No way. Batman's not stupid enough to try and come up here. We're in a damn airship. You are nothing compared to him. Make good use of that drone. I should target the soldier controlling the drone. Need to get closer. What the hell? Nothing we can do for him. We spread out, get revenge. Anyone can choke a man when his back's turned, Batman. How about a real fight? Two man teams, sweep the area, find him. Downloaded the codes. I can aim at the drone or its designated targets to turn it against them. I need you to switch off and start searching for Batman. What the hell are you doing? There's a bunch of me controlling that drone! Something's interfering with it! I lost control! It's the bat! He's screwing with it! Nice and simple. Alright, so they put a turret down. Okay? Okay. I'll keep watch. 
already out. Oh, what a shame. Now that they're out of the way, I can use that console to disable the airship's defenses. Nice work, Batman. But come on, let's be honest. It's a new suit, right? Not the worn out hero inside. Hmm. The weapon system controls are locked behind a scanner keyed to Stag's fingerprints. Without a clean set of his prints, I'm locked out. Maybe the CCTV camera feed can help me. I should scan the footage to see if Stag's hands touched any surfaces during the abduction. I might be able to reconstruct the full set of prints. Stag will have left a handprint on the floor there. I should check for other places he touched. There's more chance of getting a full set of prints. He isn't leaving any fingerprints in this frame. He touched the floor after he was thrown down the stairs. I should search for more prints. Not good enough. I need to find points where Stag is likely to have left fingerprints behind. He touched that railing when he steadied himself. I should find more prints to reconstruct a full set. Stag left a handprint near the exit to the room. I know where Stag left his prints. Now I just have to scan those locations. So, what's the deal here? Reconstructing a match using all these itty bitty pieces? Oh, and speaking of itty bitty pieces, what do you think they're going to do to Barbara? I've got an index fingerprint here. Three locations left to scan. able to reconstruct Stag's middle fingerprint. Two spots left to scan. I've completed reconstruction of Stag's thumbprint. One side left. Over here. I've got the full set. I should be able to access Stag's computer system now. So you 
they're going to use a reconstruction of Staggy's handprint to access the computer. Oh, that's genius, Pats, really. Oh, I know. When you're done, let's hack his online dating profile. Mm -hmm. I can't remotely disable the turrets on the other airship, but I can control the turrets on this ship. That's the weapon uh, so dealt none. with. Scarecrow's next. Alright, we will head to the second airship. That's probably where I'm going to end it. But, yeah. About the way we came, but now we can go through the doors. So, use the and. identity of this so-called Arkham Knight. What have you found? Nothing, sir. And none of the former Arkham City inmates who remain unaccounted for fit the Knight's profile. Widen the search. When Joker took over the asylum, dozens of inmates escaped. Focus on young men with military experience. Downloading the files now, sir. Enemies down there. This is the introduction of what the, hell did you do to the medics me? electrifying the dudes, now, which is annoying. Bolts. The militia's combat suits can temporarily carry an electric charge. I won't be able to hit them when they're in that state. You bastard. Right, anyway, that is the end of that part. But yeah, next time we will be searching for Mr. Stag. So uh, yeah, look forward to that and I will catch you next time.